Okay, this is going to be a quick little video. It would have to be because I've only got about seven minutes of recording time. But I have this APC Smart UPS 1400 here. That I just got batteries for and they're fully charged. And now we're going to do a runtime calibration. So I had in order to do that, I actually had to buy this, which is a 500 watt halogen work lamp. Just a cheap little thing. It's really cheap. I had to assemble that by hand, which is not fun. And I didn't quite do it right. I'm supposed to put these hooks into something else, although I don't really see how that works. Well, I'll fix it later, but uh, for right now, I just gotta deal with this thing. Now, in order to perform a runtime calibration on these, you need to have, I think APC recommends like a 30% load, 30 plus. Um, I usually go with 50. So this is a 500 watt lamp. This is a 950 watt UPS, 1400 volt amps. You can see right there with its nameplate rating. Well, if it would focus, you could see it. There we go. So we'll go ahead and uh, now that it is fully charged, I smell burning. I'm sure that lamp is going to catch fire or something. <laughs> uh, hopefully not. Here's our runtime calibration. So now you just got to let that thing drain. When you're doing this, you've got to let it run all the way down. Now, of course, the battery gauge is not going to be proper, so I wouldn't trust that. All right, so UPS has now dropped the load. So you go ahead. Now, I don't know if you're technically supposed to do this or not, but I'm going to disconnect the load. I'll plug it back in and let it recharge itself. Maybe I shouldn't have left it on. It's probably going to fail that. Uh, that probably was a mistake. Yeah, it's pretty upset. So we'll let that charge. Yeah, and then that'll be that. That'll probably take... I'm sure it'll take a while, so... Here's how you perform a calibration on one of these things.